Hello and welcome to Zippo Lion's Den. This is a recently acquired purchase of mine, of which I made a short earlier today, showing how dirty it was when I first got it and how much it needed cleaning. Well, I finished cleaning it, and now I want to show it to you. It is a 1975 Zippo Purina Kitten Chow which is the whole reason why I bought it. I got it cheap. I paid like 20 bucks, I think. Had some corrosion in it here and there. It was in rough shape, needed love. Wasn't, didn't even make the click sound when you opened it, and now it does. Cleaned up really, really nice. There was rust all in there and everything. Rust on the wheel. And it cleaned up really good. Insert. Cleaned up beautifully. Time appropriate for the 70s. And like I said, it cleaned up really nice. The flint, the camp spring was just covered with rust. And I have to admit that I joined the bandwagon of soaking it in vinegar. Because Wow, did that make a difference. Soaked it for about 10 minutes. And it came out really nice. It's got a loose hinge, which I'm not too worried about. I might send it in to get fixed. I might try fixing it myself. Not entirely sure. But I needed a 1975 for my 70s collection. And this is the one I got. And I just think it's cool. I've never seen a kit, Purina Kitten Chow Zippo. And when this came up on eBay, I was like, well, I'll try bidding on that. And I think I want it for like $20 plus shipping. Which is, you know, for the shape that it was in. Wasn't all that great, I guess. But it cleaned up okay. It's got a little bit of history. It's been loved, well used. But it cleaned up rather nice, I think. Like I said, if you check out the latest short that I have before this video, you can see how dirty it really was and how much of a good cleaning it needed. I was able to save the old asbestos wick. I never plan on using it, so I don't worry about that. And it clicks now. It didn't do that before. And the reason it didn't is because the cam... The camp spring was so rusted and so much corrosion down in here, it came down to about that far and that was it. It wouldn't come down decent by itself. Well now, after a good cleaning, it works just fine. So, I hope you like it. I like it. Like I said, I needed an 1875 for my 70s collection and I just thought this was a nice little addition to it if you like what you see please hit the like button subscribe anything you do will help this little channel grow and i hope you have a great night thank you